Okay, you guys, it just keeps getting real here. It is time to clean my oven and I'm going to do it on video so that you guys can see how easy and safe and no gloves, no masks. Um, all I'm using is the Norwex oven and grill cleaner and I've got my ball of water and this is called a Spirinet. It's seen better days, but you know what? It just keeps on going. It's basically just steel wool. Um, we also have one that has a little handle on it, which is really great for protecting your nails if you care. But all I'm gonna do is just get this wet. Now I've preheated my oven. I'll open the door here. I've preheated my oven um, to 100 degrees, okay? And the way that you can tell if it's too hot is if it steams. Oh, can you see that? Better show you. I'm gonna do the door, okay? And it looks like it's okay. Some ovens, pretty much now, they don't preheat um, any lower than 100, so you wanna actually stop it when it gets to 100. All right, maybe what I'll do is I'll just bring you a little bit closer here so you can see. Okay, so all I've done is I've just let that sit on the glass, and then just takes a couple minutes. I'm just gonna scrub away. The water just kind of helps it move around. Um, this is an enzyme, so it's completely just naturally eating everything on the glass. And it is so awesome. You can, I can feel it coming off. And it uh, takes a little, just not hardly any scratching. Like I'm not pushing at all, I'm being quite quite light with my hands. Woohoo, I can't wait. It's so great. Okay, and then all I gotta do is wipe it off. So now I'll just grab my viral claw. I have to get one out of my drawer. Okay, Enviro cloth. Wipe. Look at that. Pretty great. The other way you can do it is also with the cleaning paste, but I really, really just love this. You gotta see this. Okay, so I have sprayed in the oven cleaner and I've let it sit for a few minutes and just did a little test spot there. Yes, it is this bad. We have had um, many pies and pizzas in here going and dripping. And so I will just show you how it's just coming off. You see that? It just eats it. And all you do is you just keep going. It's coming. I will come back and I'll show you when it's done. Okay, I just wanna show you where I'm at. So I have gotten most of it off, but I decided to employ the cleaning paste because um, there was just some really hard stuff that was baked on there. And I'm just gonna wipe it off and show you where it's at. Okay, wow. So the two of them work really well together because the oven and grill got like the main stuff off and then some of the stuff that's just really really baked on is coming off with the cleaning paste and I'm just gonna do another couple minutes and then I will show you the finished result okay wiping it out Okay, that is a lot of it gone. Looks like I could do a whole bunch more, but um, I'm really happy with those results from both the oven cleaner and the cleaning paste. Now to maybe put a liner in there so that uh, everything else that drips doesn't have to get cleaned out again for a long time. <laughs>